In the previous part, we already add the rubbish bin at each of the these items, and now we are going to add this delete function to this rubbish bin so we can delete that specific item. Now we back to our project and we go back to the top and now we are going to create constant delete to do and then we use the async function so we pass the id because we want to get the id and then we can delete the specific item at the strapi now we use the api dot delete to do of course we need to pass the id and then we have the result after we delete the to do we want to read the to do again so we get the latest list of the to-dos and then we set the to-dos dot data so we go back to and then we set on click and then we go to buy the to three to-do functions and because we need to pass the ID so we have to write like this and now if we go back to here and we try to delete the item that we just create and we can see there is an error that the server respond with the status of 405 method not allowed and when we go back to the API folder and we back to the index we can see we have double forward slash and actually we should only have one forward slash and now we save it and now if you refresh the page it said it has to use the unique key at the array so we have to back to the app.js and inside the map functions and we have to pass the key and the key is the to do dot id and we save it and we refresh and it said it has some format problems or uh, it should not used inside the react because we do not have has the class name so we have to convert these to jsx so we right click and convert html to jsx or uh, we just change this to class name and we do not have view rule now if we refresh the page the order error has gone and now we try to delete this again and now you can see the delete functions work and you can see the items also deleted and if you look at this and go back to the to do's and you can see it changed from three to do's to two to do's so it showed the delete functions work successfully